Hi, this is Paul from TradeTheFifth.com and this is my daily stocks signals video for Thursday the 28th of February. Today I'm going to combine our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite with our Black Box Breakout Indicator Suite on two different time frames, multiple time frame strategy, just to get the entry uh, for this good looking uh, long trade on CAH there. So first of all, we've had a signal on the daily time frame on our black box breakout indicator here. So the black box breakout indicator recognizes we got increased volume from the day before. It's closed higher. Um, we've got the contraction in price action, so it's all good. It puts the signal out at 54.35 uh, and then 52.49 is the stop loss there. The little bubbles denote that. So. On the daily time frame, we can see we've got the wave for pullback there, and we've had uh, a boost from earnings, and then we've had this low volume profit taking into our green zone, our probability zone. So this is the Think or Swim trading platform, the Elliott Wave Indicator Suite and the Black Box Breakout Indicator from TradeTheFifth.com are both available on this Elliott, on this uh, Think or Swim. Uh, platform. The thing is with our setup for a fifth wave for a daily, we're a little bit too soon and sometimes these get these on the daily go a little bit too shallow. As we can see from our stochastic here, we've, we've not really gone down to the oversold zone yet and that could cross and turn back up. So we've got to be prepared and look on a multiple time frame strategy for uh, confirmation really of support. So I like to use the four hour time frame. Uh, especially for swing trading it's really good this fifth wave move so we can see now that fourth wave on the four hour time frame has found support in our EMA cloud at the green zone good rejection in the first four hours of yesterday's session there with that doji and then we moved high we didn't move high with higher volume on that second uh, four hours but it, it was okay so we've got a great crossover on the stochastic against a false breakout here. So false breakout on the stochastic in the, on the middle sub chart denotes a really strong bullish trend. And we, we confirm that on the daily. But then we've pulled back against there and crossed over in the oversold zone. So the likelihood is it wants to return there. And all it will take is some bullish markets. And this sector is doing pretty well at the moment. XBI ETF is, is on fire. Um, we know we've got uh, the, the 535 oscillator just down between 19 and 140 cents, and that's good. So we go for a sensible entry. Uh, the entry again comes from the daily, but to check that, I use a regression trend channel here going from the three to the four. And I want to make sure my entry is outside of this shorter term pullback trend here, which it is. The 5435 is outside of this trend channel. It was the first time on this uh, profit taking pullback that that's occurred. And that's a good signal. So I've combined that four hour and that the daily signal get that I got from the black box breakout indicator. I've come down to the four hour just to confirm that wave four is good on an on intraday time frame. Uh, looks good. Good support formed yesterday. And if it does break that 54.35, we're out of this regression trend channel. The 5.35 is good. The stochastic is good. Our multiple time frame dot cloud is mainly all green then. If we start to move up, that'll go all green again with a green square at the top, denoting a really strong bullish trend. So all looks good. Uh, so just a reminder, CAH. OK, we're going to trade this off multiple time frames really but the entry is 54.35 stop loss 52.49 the target is up here around about 58 dollars it's the fifth wave target for both the daily and the four hour um, and, and that's a, a risk reward of one to two so really good risk reward Simple setup. Yes, I've used a little bit more of a complicated strategy, but I do teach this multiple time frame strategy on our elite uh, training course on tradethefifth.com. So you can learn how to use this. Combining uh, a couple of different strategies, our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite and the Black Box Breakout Indicator to get some really good looking trades. Okay, so that's it for today. Have a great trading day and I'll speak to you all tomorrow.